So when you're connecting power to your board, you need, you need to be sure that you get the right lines going to the right pins. And so as you can see uh, on your own board, uh, the two pins on the far side here are one and two respectively. And then the next film, of course, would be three and four. And the two power pins are pins one and two, and the two ground pins are pins three and four. So with, with, with our board, we've been using pins one and three, uh, this pin here and this pin here, as our power and ground respectively. So when we plug it in, the cable goes over pins one and pins three, and we have the, the red cable going over to the positive end of our, of our nine volt battery, and the black cable going to the negative end of our nine volt battery. And it works like a charm. So the first step is to hold down the learn button here and apply power to your board. And wait two seconds while this light is on and then let go of the button. You are now in learn mode and it's ready to uh, learn the first button. And so it li lights up the zero LED. Okay, so now I'll, I'm gonna press the button I want to associate with this on my remote and I'm gonna let go of it right after the light goes off and then do it one more time to make sure it's in. So I press the button and I go. And then do it again. So it moved on to the next light, meaning that I got the first one right. So now I do the same thing with my next three buttons. And again. And now the third button, number two. And the last one. And you've learned now. So you can press all the buttons and they work. And it's really cool. <laughs>